When you think KC, you likely think barbecue, jazz, our Royals, or Chiefs. But this guy, I'm sure, also comes to mind, Mayor Sly James. This morning, I'm sitting down with him for a special Morning Joe, looking back at how far our city came in 2017. Mayor Sly James is going on six years in office, and in his most recent year, Kansas City has seen tremendous change. What has been the most exciting thing that's happened, uh, you know, over the past year for KC? Certainly the airport vote has been uh, pretty phenomenal, 76 percent. Uh, Did that surprise you, the 76 part? A little bit, yeah. um, you know, uh, you know, especially when we heard so many negatives. He attributes the overwhelming yes vote to the work of his team. Every time that we've had a big movement, airport, um, streetcar, uh, downtown hotel, turn the page KC, the geo bond issue, every single time that we've needed something big done, we've been able to find people who understood it and wanted to work on it. Knowing what you know now, what would you say to yourself six years ago when you walked through these doors for the first time as mayor? Uh, get more storage space for stuff. Uh. <laughs> I do notice there's a lot going on in this office. It's filled with gifts from Kansas Cityans, like this giant painting, even a bobblehead. But of course, he admits he'd tell himself a few other things too. You can't be paralyzed by praise or criticism. And you just have to have faith in your decision-making process. He's developed thick skin over the years. Popularity in his position doesn't always come easy. I've got a great family. They get it. Uh, they're supportive. But that's just one tough part of the gig. Another challenge, something you and I may take for granted. I'm never alone. You know, I'm either here. If I'm in a vehicle, I'm with the officers. When he does find alone time, he says he likes to retreat. I like to read. I love music, love music. While 2017 will go down as a banner year for him, the mayor admits he's going into 2018 with two major issues in mind. The issues of race in this country are still bubbling. And the other is crime in a state where guns proliferate and are available to anybody damn near at any time. Um, it's damn near impossible to lower the rates of homicides when there are so many guns on the street. And he says it's his mission to use his position to spark change. I will tell you this, this job is probably the best gig that I've had uh, and one that I really do like. It's one where I feel like I'm actually being able to be helpful and contribute. So yeah, great conversation yeah. I had with him, and it was interesting to see his office. He has so much stuff I was from say, so it looks many people. Really, like, busy it in it there. is, yeah. He says so <laughs> many people will send him stuff and uh, KC memorabilia, and he loves it. And he's very appreciative of all of it. If you ever have somebody that you think would be good to interview for Morning Joe, be sure to let me know. You can always email me or find me on Facebook.